She got the ice, the, the amaretto cream and all that good stuff. Three, two, one. Go. Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. I am Crystal O, and today I have a special guest, my husband. Back again. Back again for this video. So today we're going to be doing a video about tasting our cake from one year ago. Yeah. Yeah? How are you mm -hmm. feeling about that? I didn't know this was a thing. Okay. So if you know nothing about wedding cakes, I actually didn't know this. I actually only heard of it as like a ancient thing that used to be done, but apparently it's still done today. So the topper of your wedding cake is made specifically to last for at least a year if you deep freeze it. So that's exactly what the top of my cake was made of. My cake was made by a bakery pastry store in Houston, Texas called Cakes by Gina. So she let me know that after a year, we can eat the topper as long as we save it properly and thaw it and you know restore it back to, I guess, bread properly. So, ta -da! we are going to try it out and give our first impressions of tasting our wedding cake a year after our wedding. Let's hope I don't get diarrhea. <laughs> Let's just pray. You'll be all right. All right You'll be yeah. all right. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we're about one year in, right? But it's been one year in like two months. Okay. So this topper is a one year topper. So let's just pray everything is in alignment. Okay. All right. So we're going to go ahead and get this cake out real quick. Babe, do you want to share anything specifically about the cake that from the day of the wedding? Uh, last time I tried to cut this cake, I nearly cut my, my finger because mm -hmm. I missed the cake somehow. Okay. Um, let's hope that doesn't happen again. Well, this cake was really good from what I remember, even though it was like one year ago. It was really, really good. It has like a raspberry, like cream, like very mousse cream filling on it. And then it also has like a, um, a white, um, what do they call it, babe? Um, what's that taste called? Uh, Remember that, that, that fancy word? Yeah. What is uh, it? Uh, I have to figure it out now. It's going to kill me if I don't. Amaretto? Amaretto! There you go, baby. So basically, amaretto. yes. So basically, there's an amaretto filling as well as a... Raspberry filling on like an amaretto and vanilla cake. So good, y'all. So good. So basically, this is what the topper is looking like. I'm going to show you guys what it looks like now. And also, I'm going to insert a picture of what it looked like on our wedding day. This was what our, my mother was able to salvage and wrap up before everyone basically destroyed the cake. So shout out to mom for hooking us up with this topper for our one year anniversary to eat basically mm -hmm. all right so let's go ahead and you know devour this bad boy okay yeah, I don't know about devour <laughs> but, <laughs> just taste. Um, let's taste so I'm smelling a little bit of some you know deep deep um, freezing like you know how you put f food in a freezer with other stuff and you kind of smell like other foods yeah. Having rubbed off on it slightly, the smell. Yeah, a little bit. A little bit. Hopefully inside will be better. So I went ahead and followed the instructions that I was given for the cake. Um, so basically I was supposed to thaw it in the fridge first. And I think that's basically it. You want me to check real quick just to make sure? You, you didn't check? <laughs> Alright. <laughs> hey, no, no, no. Video canceled. No, no, no. Video not canceled. I did check, but I didn't read it fully through. Let me... Let me go back and just look at that real quick. Okay, there it goes, right here. Boom, baby, right here, right here. We got this. Okay, so the instructions say, for, okay, the instructions say, place the, oh. The keep your cake in the freezer until a day before your anniversary date. Slowly allow for the cake to defrost in the refrigerator, then serve and enjoy. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Do so you want to go ahead and cut it with me? Look on our wedding day? Three, two, one. Yay! I think that's it, yeah. That's it. Yeah, there's another one over there. Okay, all right, let's go ahead and cut this other side. Ready? I love you forever and ever. Love you forever and ever. Cut. Bam. Ooh, okay, that popped up pretty easily. 
There you go. We're going to show the people first. Okay. So, I'm going to go ahead and grab mine. Slap. Uh oh. See that? This is basically what we're working with right here. So, we have our slices. Mine is a little smaller than his. If I like it, I'll probably go back for more. Exhibit B. Yeah, I showed them. All right. Are you ready? I'm ready. Ready. Three. Make sure you get the ice, the ice, the uh -huh. amaretto cream and all that good stuff. Ready. Three, two, one. Go. Mm. Okay. It's not bad. Okay. Not bad. It's not bad. It's it crazy. It definitely has a freezer taste, like you said. But yeah. It's still good though. Definitely has freezer taste. Um. Hmm. Icing's good. Icing tastes amazing. Not too hard. Yeah. You know what I'm really impressed with? That the amaretto is still like just as good. Mm -hmm. Like from that day. Yeah. The flavoring. Man. Yeah. The only confusing part about like I guess the cake is that how do you keep cakes from not having that freezer taste? Yeah, it's, it's not bad. <laughs> Do you want some more? Mm, I'll just take that. Are you going to take this whole thing? You know? No, no. Here you go. You have the back side. So, there you have it, friends. We have tasted that part. Ooh! Mm -mm. You taste that? Yeah, what about it? It's like a stronger pizza taste. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. <laughs> <laughs> that ain't it. That ain't it. <laughs> that ain't it. Mm -mm. <laughs> That's not what we came here for. Okay. No, ma'am. No, sir. Mm -mm. Well, it's it wasn't bad, but on a scale of one to ten, one being like horrible, ten being the best, I would give it like a five. Solid five. Wedding day, solid ten. One year later, a solid five. What would you give it, babe? I'll give it a seven. <laughs> Stop. What? Are you serious? Wow. For a cake that's a year later? That's true. That's true. I'll give it a seven. Well, there is to go. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video of us tasting our wedding cake on our anniversary. Well, not on our anniversary, but tasting our wedding cake a year after, a year and two months after our Please wedding day. Please pray for us. If Please pray for our stomachs. We'll give an update video. <clears throat> From the toilet. No, we won't. Amen. man, that guy's great. <laughs> but yeah, <laughs> please pray for us because we do both have pretty weak stomachs. So mm -hmm. we are hoping that we will we will be okay. All right. So if you have not checked out our wedding video, make sure you check that out. Check it out now. Check it out. It. it is a tearjerker. So grab some yeah. tissues. Okay. Go ahead and snuggle up on your couch or whatever you want to snuggle up on and watch that. Um, we enjoyed making this video even though it was very random and very, you know, different. But I hope you guys enjoyed it. Comment below what you guys thought of this video. And make sure you subscribe if you are not already subscribed. Like this video and I will see you guys next time on my channel. Bye! So you really think that it was like a 7? For a year later. For a year later, yeah, I'll give it that. It still has its moistness too, you yeah, know? That's why you give it seven. It's not like it's like a dry. It's like it has its everything it needs to to have to be a good cake. Yeah. It's so interesting. Yeah. Just that that the freezer taste entered it. That's kind of yeah. what what I think has made it less. Yeah. Boy, if you don't get your big. So this is basically what the cake looks like on the inside. As you can see, it does still look very moist. Um, before we nearly smashed the cake. <laughs> Before it nearly fell down, um, this is kind of what the decoration still looks like. Everything is basically still intact, which is pretty cool. But yeah, that's what it looks like. Don't they